The vice president's open declaration of his interest in the top seat come 2012 has elicited more reaction within the PNU coalition than he had anticipated. And when Internal Security Minister Professor George Saitoti described Kalonzo Musioka's Triple K alliance as selfish, little did he know the backlash would be just as swift. And the response has been exactly that, swift. A section of MPs from Eastern and Central Kenya have dismissed his reaction as panicky, perhaps due to the realization that he is not the automatic presidential choice for PNU party come 2012. So we are telling him, let him wake up. Nobody will take the presidential ticket to him at Alambia House. And those who want to bite the dust, when I say, I'm going to kwa sababu mambo bado inakuja. Hii ni kiojo tu hakuna kitu kimefanyika. Kwa hivyo watu waache kutetemeka. The MPs also took issue with Saitoti's leadership, further fueling speculation that plans might be afoot to strip him of the PNU chairmanship. Let him lead the party from the front. Not not the comrade John who thinks that he'll be able to get the the thing uh, the presidential ticket on a silver plate platter by virtue that he's the chairman, the PNU chairman. No, it won't come easy. It won't. Gatanga MP Peter Kenneth has been widely seen as a potential successor to Saitoti, a fact he has since disowned. Manake watu wanafikiri wanaweza ingia kati yako na mimi. Wanaweza ingia katika urafiki wako na urafiki wangu. The MP staff response to Saitoti's anti-Kalonzo remarks is no doubt an indication of the vicious Kibaki succession battle within PNU. Francis Gashuri, Citizen TV.